When Mick Mars quit touring, it was assumed that the reason behind this was the 71-year-old bone disease had finally caught up with him and made it impossible for Mick Mars to carry on being Mick Mars. Obviously, the rumour mill kicked in and whispers abounded that he had either quit or been pushed, but the company line was that he left due to not physically being able to carry on anymore. But according to Carmine of Peace, there might have been more to it than that. Talking to Ultimate Guitar, Carmine of Peace revealed he'd been talking to Mick Mars, who told him, when I was on the stadium tour, I was not happy. Carmine continued, basically, everything was on tape. It was all planned out and ultimately a lot of crap. And Mick is a pretty good player. And so to now let him loose and play the way he wants, that was never going to work for him. The truth is that everything has been weird for a while with Motley Crue, and Mick didn't like the fact that everything was on tape. Mick told me that people that came to see it could tell that it was all pre-recorded and that everything was on tape. When you play in a stadium like that, you can hear a lot of things come to the monitors or what doesn't. And with Vince's vocals, bass, drums, guitars and all the other stuff, it was obvious it was all on tape. And Mick was pissed off and said, I can play these things, I want to play them, I don't want to make believe I'm playing them. So I think that's one reason why he said I'm done. Sure, the disease that he has doesn't help and it doesn't make life easy on tour, but Mick can play all the licks and he was allowed to. It also seems that Mick Mars told him that he wasn't getting along with the other members of crew, as Carmine explained. He had his own means of travel and would travel alone on a bus while the other guys flew everywhere. He said, man these guys are pissing their money away, flying to every gig. They were all busy still trying to be rock stars and Mick just wanted to play the music. Mick wasn't interested in wasting time and money flying everywhere so he travelled by bus. Their lifestyles are different to his and so there were a lot of disagreements. I think he was just done. They were supposed to have done their last tour and then they came back. Then they did the stadium tour and that was apparently supposed to be the last. So when they came back again he said, you can do it, I'm not going out with you for this. We're not quite sure what to make of all this. After all, there's no reason for Carmine Peace to lie, but it seems weird that Mick Myers himself hasn't spoken on the subject. What do you think? Sound off in the comments and let us know.